Hi guys, in today's video I will show you how to properly position objects for 3D printing. The first type of an object is a tall thick model of tubular shape. In case of horizontal printing, the side which is laying on the print bed doesn't look good. The first option is printing the object vertically. Don't forget to use a brim function. This object wouldn't be very solid, it can break by horizontal layers. Another option is slicing the model lengthways. We can use slicer for doing that. And then glue the parts together. Layers are laid horizontally, so the final object is much more firm. Printing horizontal straight bridges without support is possible. The bottom side wouldn't be perfectly smooth, but in some cases, when you can't use a supper material, it is the only solution. The printer can tense the filament between bases if the path of the print head is straight. The bridge is completed by laying following layers. According to the model position, adjust the direction of printing or rotate the model. Printing a spinning bridge into the void is not possible. You have to use support material. But remember, in a lot of cases you can solve a problem with just rotating or slicing the model. Slicing allows you to print more complex models that couldn't be printed without support. Make sure your model is laying on the bed by area which is enough large and flat and the angle of overhanging parts is ideally more than 45 degrees. Check the layer step after generating the G-code from downloaded models. The whole first layer has to lay on the bed. Some of the models haven't a flat bottom. Because of this, object won't stick properly to the bed or the lower layers won't fit nicely. You can slice a few millimeters from the bottom in slicer, if the model allows you to. In the next video we will continue positioning objects. I will show you how to deal with overhanging parts, so don't forget to subscribe.